Obviously, you guys were excited by the job report, but maybe a little too excited, uh, both you and the president, um, tweeting within an hour of the jobs data coming out, uh, which is a violation of federal rules. So I'm wondering, I guess, both if there is counseling in viewing the president's future, uh, but also what you say generally to critics who say the risk of doing this is politicizing what should be kind of nonpartisan by the books. No, uh, what, I, what I understand is that that rule was instituted uh, to deal with, with market fluctuations. I could be wrong, but I believe that's why it was instituted. I think tweeting out, great way to start a Friday, here are the actual numbers that you all have reported, um, is a bit silly. I mean, don't make me make the podium move. Um, I, <laughs> I mean, honest to God, like every every reporter here reported out that we had 235,000 jobs, 4.7. There isn't a TV station that didn't go live to it. So to tweet out, great way to start a Friday, I think, yes, the president was excited to see more Americans back to work. Uh, I don't think that's exactly a market disruption. Um, I think that there's a lot of excitement in this country when we look at uh, the policies that the president has instituted. Uh, to help m put more Americans back to work. So, I, I mean, I, I understand the rule, but let's... Sure, the Obama White House, for instance, you know, went out of their way not to comment in that hour-long period. They would rearrange the president's schedule around it. I, I mean, it was something that they... I, I, I get it. And I, and and I think there's a difference going club. forward. Yeah, it, I, it's not about commenting. I think it's one thing to give analysis and whatever, literally tweeting out great news. I think, yes, we're excited that, that when the president and the rest of the team um, saw the news this morning as reported on every television station, Twitter, the internet, uh, and every major news site in, in the country and around the world. We were excited to see so many Americans back to work. So I apologize if we were a little excited and we're so glad to see so many fellow Americans back to work. Uh, but that's Ashley. The Vice President in November did lay out that General Flynn was being paid to lobby um, for Turkish interests 